test is you reduce the bank guarantee values and return the bank guarantees partially. Next. And uh, during uh, digital engineering also, we have been facing certain issues. The main reason for that is that though we discuss case to case each and every point on its technical merit, and though it is convinced by CMPD also most of the cases, the final word what we hear sir is, it is mentioned in the NIT so I cannot change it. Though it is known that it is not correct. For example, the building sizes what we are suggesting in NIT is, See, CMPD says one number of compounds, single story RCC complete masonry building of 120 square meter is required. When we calculate actual requirement based on the number of pumps and its sizes, it comes to 256. <coughs> Fair enough. We give 256 square meter because it is technical requirement. But unfortunately, most of the times happen, what happens is we don't calculate it at the same stage. It's not possible. To do the detail engineering at the time of tender is absolutely not possible. We go by the sizes what mentioned by CMPD. That is why what we request to you is CMPD can do some basic work and say that come approximately closer to the sizes which are required. So that our estimations will be proper. Now in this case, first case you said 120 square meters. We have given 250 square meters because I cannot reduce it because it is required. In second case, in compressor house, you said 216 kilo square meters are required. But when technically I have shown you calculations and all that, 120 square meters is enough. But 120 square meters CMPD is not ready to accept because it says that I mentioned minimum 216. Sometimes we tell them, maybe you must have interchanged it. No, nothing doing. They say nothing doing. Minimum we mentioned, if it is minimum, at least you should give. It is a waste of, you know, it is waste of money, it is waste of space, everything. So we request the MPD to look into it. Our groundwater reservoir for portable water dust suppression for fight fighting, minimum capacity, reservoir capacity should be 600 cubic meter, whereas it is coming to 1103. <coughs> Do the detail engineering before tender. <laughs> the time given is not sufficient and it is not possible also. So the values what you are mentioning at least should be slightly closer to the actual requirement. And uh, these are the few things which we thought of telling. Uh, as per TA, TAC now, side end spacing <coughs> is 45 meters with single head end, but in the United States, 30, 30 meter spacing is required which is not at ESC's uh, norms, but uh, just like that it is asked for 30 meters. So these can be corrected. Uh, similarly for hydrant for MWS, the number of pumps that we are asking are not asked for the ESC norms again. So there also you can reduce number of pumps. And the other thing is that you know, you mentioned one kilometer roads are to be built in the plant. But when we when you take the calendar, calendar, these are not in uh, manufacturing range now. Uh, we have changed it to other models, other types. So when we come to CMP again, they say that no, 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 you have to give us for the previous NIT. So NIT is okay. It, you know, sometimes we, by oversight all that, without, uh, it, it, for so many other reasons. It could have been mentioned. But uh, you know, based on the merit, uh, based on the present conditions, based on uh, we have given the certificates from manufacturers saying that no, we are not manufacturing this. Earlier we used to manufacture. That is obsolete. Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's a typograph. Yeah, yeah. Right. So my request to you is let us have some provision in MIT itself saying that wherever there is a technical requirement comes with the deviations that needs to be accepted based on the so many other factors. If manufacturing is not manufacturing, how can an EPC contract with supply? We cannot supply it. For example, now we have the uh, fan cooling, natural cooling, there are so many other things. We have, we have given the certificates also from manufacturers. But uh, the problems are, you know, being uh, 
nobody is ready to take the decision and see that, you know, yes, this is the right thing, this needs to change. It may be, okay, you have mentioned. I don't know what reason you have mentioned. But uh, facts are different. And the uh, choose also, cascade choose for triple conveyor has been also in some of the tenders where we are executing. But uh, these are required only for the ad fitting. It is not required for the uh, uh, triple conveyors. We, we, with our, ours, uh, we have a lot of experience. We have executed our 30 plants and uh, other equipment manufacturers also suggesting. So, <coughs> so these are the issues we immediately request the higher ups of CMPD, kindly look into them and uh, at least uh, avoid these things in the coming tenders. So that's all. And other things, there are so many other issues, small, small things are there, like electrical items, standards, electrical cables also, there are certain certain standards you are asking us to follow. But uh, those standards are being upgraded to different standards. Those things we will put a mail, but we thought, uh, some major important things needs to be discussed here, so we have to Thank you so much. Uh, thank you, Mr. Scantec, India Private Limited. Uh, now, now I would like to invite uh, Mrs. Eastman Crushers uh, to present their part, please.